funding. Facebook's independent fact checker may not be so independent after all. A U.S. congressman has questioned the impartiality of factcheck.org, which is supposed to tackle vaccine disinformation because it's indirectly funded by jab manufacturer Johnson & Johnson. Who pays the paychecks of the fact checkers? The vaccine fact checkers at factcheck.org, who claim to be independent, are funded by an organization that holds over $1.8 billion of stocks in a vaccine company and is run by a former director of the Centers for Disease Control. The fact checking account responded to the accusations by making clear its funding sources. The Robert Wood Johnson Foundation is one of the benefactors and holds billions in Johnson & Johnson stock. The foundation's CEO is Richard Besser, who was a former acting director of the Centre for Disease Control. But factcheck.org claims there's no interference in its editorial decisions and the foundation's views aren't necessarily reflected in its decisions. But author and liberal studies expert Michael Rechtenwald believes such connections pose risks to the public. This is absolute collusion on the part of uh, vaccine manufacturers having funding the uh, fact checkers on social media. So we're actually getting to the point where people's lives are being endangered. We've lost all confidence in the social media and our mainstream media entirely. Anything that comes into contradiction with the leftist agenda is deemed misinformation. People are now not able to get information about what's best for their health, including the detriments of the vaccine.